was a pillar of support behind this program. When we approached him the first time mentioning about this program, he was gracious to offer his support to us. And today, if this program is happening, along with all our other, support, other sponsors, it is because of the support that we had from Mr. Alexander Wadakadam. It is my privilege to welcome Mr. Alexander Wadakadam on behalf of Stewards India International. You're welcome, sir, to this evening. We have today here Mr. Thomas George, Deputy Ch Chief Financial Officer of Gulf Bank, who is also our grand sponsor, and he is with us today here. May I now welcome Mr. Thomas George on behalf of Stewards India International to this music evening. <clears throat> Mr. Philip Burgess, Marketing Manager of Gulf Air, is our silver sponsor and he is with us today here. It is my privilege to welcome Mr. Philip Burgess on behalf of Stewards India International to this musical evening today. We also have the director of Parvision TV, Mr. Thomas Abraham, who is also the silver sponsor of this evening's program. May I use this opportunity to welcome Mr. Thomas Abraham to this evening's function. We also have from Western Union, Mr. Philip Koshi and Mr. Raman Nair, who also have supported us uh, by extending us the silver sponsorships. Today, if we are running these programs, I would like to again remember and remind all of you that it's because of the backing of our sponsors. It's my pleasure to welcome Mr. Philip Koshi and Mr. Raman Nair of Western Union. The list of our sponsors are very long. We have, I think, close to 50 other sponsors who have sponsored us in different manner and who have made everything possible that, uh, that we could do such a wonderful program today evening. Our welcome, warm welcome, is extended to the representatives of all the other sponsoring entities today evening. We also have Mr. Ranjit Alexander. He's a director and general manager of Adonai Shipping from Dubai. He has traveled all the way from Dubai and he is here today to come and attend this function and to grace this function with his presence. It is our privilege to have him here and may I take this opportunity to welcome him to this musical night program. Mr. Sajee Paul, director of Power Vision TV and director of Crompton International based in Qatar. He has also been kind to travel all the way from Qatar and be here today with us to grace this function with his presence. It is my privilege, it is my honor to welcome Mr. Saji Paul to this music live wire concert. Mr. M. Matthews, don't need a big introduction in Kuwait as well as in the rest of the world as far as the Indian community is concerned. Mr. M. Matthews is also here today with us to grace this occasion with his presence. Mr. Matthews, it is our privilege and honor to have you here. We welcome you today evening. We also have Mr. K.P. Koshi and his family here today. It is our privilege to have you, Mr. Koshi. We thank you very much for being here. We value your presence here. You are welcome to this musical live wire concert. No musical concert is complete without the audience. And no musical concert is complete without the singers. May I take this opportunity to extend the warm greetings and welcome to all of you audience, all of you the special guests and invitees of Stewards India International, who has taken time off your busy schedules to come and be here to bless us with your presence. Welcome all of you for being here. We have the renowned singer, Mr. Vijay Benedict. You already had the opportunity to listen to or three sing songs from him. Well, the night is still young and all these talented singers are going to 
spend quite a bit of time with us singing wonderful songs. It is my honor, it is my privilege to welcome you, Mr. Vijay Benedict, to this musical live uh, concert organized by Stewards India International. We also have Mr. K.G. Marcos. He needs no introduction among the Indian crowd, especially the South Indians. It's our privilege to have you, Mr. Marcos, here today. We are honored with your presence and we enjoy listening to your songs. May I take this opportunity to welcome you on behalf of Stewards India International. We also have singers, Mrs. Anu Abraham, Ms. Lisa Mohan, Mrs. Sha uh, Shi Shija Shaju, who are going to also sing lovely songs for us today evening. We are really honored with the presence of all these talented singers here today. It is my pleasure to welcome Mrs. Anu Abraham, Mrs. Lisa Mohan, Mrs. Shija Shaju to this evening's program. A music program is not complete without the involvement of the members of the orchestra, the audiovisual team, and all of the support teams. I was just thinking, this thought was going through my mind when I was sitting there, that all of us are sitting and relaxing and listening to the songs while the people are really working hard to make this evening a wonderful evening. Are uh, the singers and the members of the orchestra team and the technical team. I think we owe them a great round of applause. It's my pleasure to welcome all of them to this wonderful evening time. We also have with us today Mr. John Thomas, the advisor of Stewards India International, Mr. Kunya Kodiat, advisor of Stewards India International, Mr. Abraham George, advisor of Stewards India International with us. Uh, Mr. Kunya Kodiat has traveled all the way from India to come and attend this function. It's our privilege to welcome all the three advisors of Stewards India International, Mr. John Thomas, Mr. Kunya Kodiat, Mr. Abraham George. We welcome you to this evening. We have a long list of the Stewards family here. We like to be called as Stewards members and Steward team rather than being designated with positions and uh, titles. There are a lot of members here who are part of the Stewards family. It's my pleasure, it's my honor to welcome all the members of the Stewards family for today evening's musical live wire concert. If I have missed anybody in my long list, it was not done deliberately. I know that there, are, there have been a lot of people who have supported us. There have been a lot of people who have worked behind this, by, behind the scenes. And if there is anyone whom I have missed out, please pardon me, it was not deliberate. I welcome you all to this evening's function. Before I close, though my duty was to welcome you all, I think I need to say three, four sentences about what Stewards India International is all about because the people who are coming and speaking after me may not be uh, taking time for that. Stewards India International is a very humble small ministry that was an idea which was given by God in the minds of seven youngsters who wanted to see what best can be done to show the compassion and love of Lord Jesus Christ to the people around us. We got registered in back, back in July 2009 with the Indian Embassy Kuwait and for the last year has been functioning by God's grace as a socio-cultural community organization doing as much as we can, as little that God allows us and as much as we can for the betterment of the our society mostly in terms of poor and the destitute and the needy back in India. As the name indicates and as our logo indicates for this evening our motto was touching lives. Now as we all know we have we are all people who have learned what Lord Jesus Christ has said. We all know that we all preach that we all practice it to an extent. But if you really want to practice it by in the sense of the meaning 
and the essence of what Lord Jesus Christ said, I think that is a great responsibility. I would like to mention that Stewards India International is not aligned with any one particular community. Our support goes out to all people who are needy and destitute regardless of their religion, community and denomination. And this is our motto because Lord Jesus Christ intended to better, to support, to take care of everybody in this earth. And he was not focused on one particular denomination, one particular religion or one particular community. It's our desire to continue this service in this manner. But as you always, as you always know, it's very difficult to continue objectives like this and it's not easy. So we all need your support and prayers in the days ahead that we will go forward with the same purpose and clarity that we had in the first day of our formation. Being a steward has a slightly different meaning. Being a steward means everything belongs to God and you take what little you need and the rest is God's. Whereas the common practice that we have in life is everything belongs to me and I give from that whatever I think is fit for to be given to God and the support of the poor and the needy. Being a steward is a tough job because it is all about every resource that we have is God's resource and we have to and we can take only what little or what, what we need or what we think is fit for us to take. This is the purpose of the organization. I don't want to I don't want to be a hindrance between the beautiful songs that is waiting for you and my speech. So may I conclude here. Once again, I welcome all of you to this wonderful evening. Thank you very much. And we are very much honored with your presence here. Thank you one and all. Thank you, Mr. Abraham, for this very warm welcome. I now take this opportunity to invite a couple of our special guests onto the dais. As I say the name, kindly come forward. We'll begin with the chairman of Ashwati Housing Private Limited and the director of Norca Root, Mr. Alexander Varakerim. Can we please have you on stage? I now ask Mr. Thomas George to step forward, the, duty, the deputy chief financial officer of Gulf Bank. The marketing manager of Gulf Air, Mr. Philip Vergis. Can we please have you on stage as well? Director of Power Vision of TV, Power Vision TV, Mr. Thomas Abraham. Can we please have you upstairs? Mr. John Thomas, Mr. Kunyu Kuriat, Mr. Abraham George, all advisors of Stewart Inter International. Please, can we have you? Mr. Ranjit Alexander, Director and General Manager of Adonai Shipping. Mr. Shaji Paul, Director, Power Vision TV and Director of Crompton International, Qatar. Can we also have Vishwa Malayali, Mr. Matthews on stage, followed by the entire executive team of the Stewards India International. Mr. Vijay Benedict and Mr. Marcos as well. Ipol, Ashwadi Housing Private Limited Chairman, Norka Root Director Maya, Mr. Alexander Vodakadam, Stuart Suvenirnde Urupradi, Gulf Bank Deputy Chief Financial Officer, Mr. Thomas George Nali Kunda, Pragashnam Narvikin. Stewards Executive, Mr. Shibu V. Sam. Sambati Mai Dhridhamani Bhavikinna, Kudumangalka Bhavanengal Dharmich Sankindhanu Lathukayoda Chekka. 